If you follow my channel for a while, you'll see me review some Works products as well as Rockwell. They're both owned by the same parent company, which is Positech. And I've had some really good experiences with them. And in the background, a lot of my videos, you probably have seen me clamp down things right here with the jaw horse. This sits outside most of the time. It's just really handy whenever I need to clamp something down to work on it or show it in a video. You'll see that it has paint splatter on it right now. And the Works Pegasus table right here is something that I've seen for the first time last year at the GIE show in Louisville. It was my first time there and I didn't realize that Works would be there. It's just really nice to meet the fine folks there and see all their cool products. So today I have the opportunity to review for you and show you how it works. This is a two-in-one battery powered. It's uh, two 20 volt batteries and it's a line trimmer and an edger. So we're gonna get this review started and show you how it works. On my channel, you're gonna see a wide variety of products that will vary between residential use, DIYers, homeowners, all the way up to the professional landscape companies. So you're gonna see that on my channel. And you're also gonna see something like this right here that works, WG184. This is, I would say, geared very well for a, a homeowner. It's lightweight, very easy to use. And this is a dual purpose. It has a wheeled edger and it's a line trimmer and it cuts a 13 inch diameter swath and to run it there's no gas to mix no winterizing of it just these two 20 volt batteries they're two amp hour batteries and they just easily clip on the back here together let me just show you this is kind of cool the way they work so they have that meter in the, there and then when you install them right here all right let me show you this here when you install that one and you install this one so you can check the power level and you can do the combined power level so you get all five so you know you're good to go. The first thing that caught my eye with this is the command feed spool system. So you push that button right there and then it will automatically feed the line out. Now when I looked at this I was wondering where the other end of it is but it does run one line coming out. This is 0 .080 thickness and it's 20 feet long that comes in this right here. So we're gonna end up putting this to the test. We're gonna edge my sidewalk and then we're going to trim it and see how it works. Uh, so my thoughts are if you're a homeowner and you're looking for something that's really easy to use and dual purpose and you're gonna do up to a half acre, this might be a good option to consider. It runs 149. All right, so let's take a look at a few of the features. So to loosen the handle, it's just really easy. You can uh, put it in position that way or this way remove it up or down on the shaft there however you want to balance and this wheel system right here this unhooks and then you can attach it up here if you want to run it as a wheel edger and this pivots so see how that you can uh, put this on the ground put your foot on the cover right here and then you can change the angle really easy so the straight shaft trimmer and then to do the edging it just rides on those wheels right there and it has a really big shield right here so that should really keep everything from flying in your face it might I don't know how that's gonna work if it's gonna obstruct your vision at all but as far as the safety of keeping things from flying in your face this is gonna do a good job for that so on the handle itself if you push this button right here you can rotate so depending if you're edging or trimming See that locks the handle. And then to pull the trigger, you push in that little safety right there and it's a variable speed trigger. Check this out. It does have a little bit of noise to it. I don't think you're gonna need hearing protection like when you have a gas engine running, uh, but it is a little bit louder than what I was anticipating. And then the command speed, you push that, watch. Okay, that's a little bit different than what I thought. So it does stop it, and then it feeds it out. It does seem like every time I stop and start it that it cuts just a little tiny bit of that line off. Let's listen to that again. Ready? I'm going to start it. Start it again. 
Okay. One of the cool things about these batteries right here, they are part of the power share program. So if you have some other works tools, you can quickly switch them out. So let's say you run these batteries out because you're working on a bigger job. You can have another pair from another works tool and just pop them in and you're good to go once again. Okay, so now we're at the part where I'm going to edge my sidewalk here. I'll just kind of quick show you how I do it. I mow it first, then I blow a lot of the grass out of the way, and then I edge it. All right, so let's get started. So I'm putting the safety glasses on. I think I can go without hearing protection, but we'll kind of get a sense of how loud it is. Okay, this is one thing I have to get used to. All the line trimmers that I use, they rotate this direction. This one rotates the other direction. So I kind of have to get used to that. Hmm, okay. <laughs> All right, so I'm guessing uh, since I haven't edged this in a while, it's probably not going to look quite as good the first time. I think once you get kind of a maintenance thing going, then it'll start looking better. Rotate that like that. So there, I think I'm all set. So now I have a straight shaft wheeled line trimmer. Okay, so here's where it's handy to be able to rotate the handle with the trigger. Just give me a little better control. Right away, I really like that clean line right there. I'm gonna set my GoPro up so we can just get a closer look over here. So the first 20 feet here seemed to be like my learning curve. I did a really great job the first probably six feet. So I did notice with the line being a little bit thinner, you are gonna to have to feed it quite a bit more. And since this is really the first time in like two months I've edged it, I'm going to probably be going through that line even faster. So I'm learning as I go, but overall, it's doing the job. And I'm happy with the power of it, um, the two batteries. That seems to work really well, so there's a little hook right there for the wall. All right, let's get the blower out. All right, so here's my edge. Just kind of two passes for the first time using it, kind of learning how to line it up and everything. So I just want to take this moment right here to clarify if a company sends me a product like Works sent this to me to test out, if I wasn't happy with it, I wouldn't post this video. But I would have to say that if you're a homeowner, do it yourselfer. If you're looking for something that's really simple and easy to use, something lightweight, something um, some people don't have the strength to really pull start equipment, and they want to do it themselves, something that's lightweight, this is going to be a good choice for you. So it's uh, not something you're going to see on the commercial landscape companies, trucks and trailers. Uh, overall though, I think there's some really cool features. I do like the patented feed system, the command feed they have, and just the way that this twist when you're going from one to the other it just really seems like it gives you great control having that trigger right there um, whether you're using it as an edge or a line trimmer and the wheel just kind of helps guide you along the way so if you own one of these please put your comments down below how it's worked for you i have seen the overall reviews of this and it seems like it has done very well people are really happy with it so if you find this video interesting and informative please give it a thumbs up and help support my channel that's it friends thanks for watching See you next time. If you like this video, I think you might like a few other videos over there to the right, so please click on those. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, hit that button down below. And if you want to see what I'm up to throughout the week, please connect with me on Twitter and Instagram. All right, friends, enjoy.